Boys, welcome back to a new reaction video. Today we're watching So Luminati, bro, and um and DDG beef again, man. You know what I'm saying? They had beef 2020 and they're beefing again. So if you're brand new, be sure you subscribe. Let's see what Gazer Gazer's gotta say. Your time has come. DDG, your name, your new name is Doodle Garbage. <laughs> Make sure for this point forward, y'all put two doodle emojis and a garbage sign next to DDG name. Your new name is Doodle Garbage. Your that's tough. That's tough. <laughs> and it is fast. Even his hoodie is like that. No way out of this one. Your time has come. Burst and burst. I've been gone for quite some time. Y'all know why. I don't even have to explain. I want to talk to you like on FaceTime. Y'all about to break this man down. Literally. I'm about to break him down. Very simple. You would never look at DDG the same after this. I promise you, this would not be like any other vid that I dropped on him. This one is deep. But first thing first, let me show you. Wow. This is why I'm dropping this video on DDG. These niggas be baloney. Got they bitches on me. I just hit Illuminati ho and then he fell off. Way too petty. Way too petty. Way too petty. Did that guy just say I hate some of them and I saw and he just fell off? Oh, what? Wow, look, triple one. I want money. Got they bitches on me. I just hit some Illuminati ho and then he fell off. T shirt, okay. Way too petty. Way too petty. Way too petty. So, as y'all can see, while I've been gone, everybody know my brother passed away last year. Shit, bro, I said, yeah, me too, man. My, um, and it, 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 my best friend passed away as well. Still, my partner. It's still something that me and my family is dealing with. And I needed to be away from YouTube and I needed to be away from everything in order to really find myself again. It's crazy that this little nigga trying to feed off my pain. You see how this little, you see this? He trying to feed off my pain. Why would you try to feed off my pain and you went through the same thing? My brother didn't deserve this at all. Um, my brother was a loving person. He never hurt anybody. Like, my nigga, you know the pain, bruh. You know this shit is nothing to play with. You know this. My yes, nigga. sir. <laughs> you know this. And I'm, I'm only showing y'all clips. I'm pretty sure y'all can make whole compilations since I've been gone of these motherfuckers talking about me. Sp especially him. Right? Mm, but listen. Yeah, I've seen, I, I seen one video of him and... Um, and Gideon. I have no idea <clears throat> what the fuck DDG been doing with his whole career. Doodle juice, doodle garbage. I have no idea what he been doing since I've been gone. But one clip I want to show y'all that sparked it all. Not even what he said about me. This is what sparked it all. Selling your soul is not a real transaction, bro. It's not even a thing. Like I used to think that too when I was like younger and shit. This is girl right here. This not his girl. He borrowing her, my nigga. Now listen, I hate that she <laughs> has to catch this straight, but that's tough. That's tough. She got to catch this straight. Her motherfucker. Bro, listen. So first thing first, the highlight of doodle garbage career right now, because I told you, remember back in the day, remember when I told you, you would never be looked at as a rapper. Remember I told you no matter how many songs you drop. What is, the, what is Doodle Garbage's top five greatest hits? Nobody knows. No matter what, no matter how much music you drop, no matter how many scripted vids, collabs you do, no matter what you do, you will always be looked at as Doodle Garbage who posts fake scripted vlogs. You're a YouTuber at heart. I see you've been pushing this TikTok song. Now you trying to become Coolie Ray? You want to be in the TikTok shit now? DDG don't know what he want to do with his music career. He don't have a sound. He sound like everybody but himself. He had, bro, listen. This is his bitch. Right? Right? It only take two seconds for you to search up Disney Expose. She's a melanated goddess, too. They love the melanated goddesses in Disney. All you gotta do is pull up TikTok. Search TikTok Disney. Wait, what? Disney what? She's a melanated goddess, too. They love... The melanated goddesses in Disney. All you gotta do is pull up TikTok. Search TikTok Disney Exposed. See what happened. 
How many celebrities from Disney has came out speaking on what the fuck has happened with them when they was kids and what's going on now in Disney? How many people got to tell y'all the hidden symbols in all these Disney movies? In all mm. these Disney cartoons. Yeah, man, the satanic symbolism. Is that real? Right? But even the monster energy drink. But, you gotta do it. <laughs> but one of the number one things I did notice, it was literally earlier this year, it was a Disney star who's black, a melanated goddess, who's black, who came out exposing everything. I think her name was China. I'm going to pull up the picture for y'all so y'all can see it. But dude, DDG, doodle garbage. My nigga. That's not your girl. You borrowing her. Why you won't tell everybody what happened in those private lodges? What do your girl go on? What happens behind the scenes with these pedophilia ass old ass men with glasses who like kids? I'm connecting stupid. We're in the Matrix. This is a Disney cartoon about Island. The, 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 this demonic anything connected to this type of shit. Go. Hopefully, Mr. Mermaid, okay? Her sister already oh, broke me. They come for the kids. It's all type of hidden symbols, hidden messages, and Little Mermaid as well. But DDG says you want to send messages to the kids, doo-doo garbage. I just got to use your bitch, for example. That's all. She got to catch this stray. That's tough. She should have wore a vest. I got to leave her on one HP. But dude, I just want to paint a picture. I even dropped a video on Patreon how they use different... Bro, listen, these is like wizards and warlocks, bro. These motherfuckers in Hollywood, it's a reason why DDG is addicted to Cali. I'm lying to the whole thing. Selling your soul, just it's just not some rapping shit or some movie shit. You got to understand, bro, majority of these people in the industry, etc., they getting they, they doing it by what they drinking and taking in, drugs, and also having sex with industry. Never have sex with industry women. They pass spirits on, bro. What the fuck? Really? I didn't know that, bro. That's that sounds messed up, man. I don't, I don't go say too much. much. Astro off spirits and shit, bro. They pass off spirits. The minute they have sex, we start to become very zesty. This is why a lot of your favorite rappers is completely changing and polishing their nails. It's the spirits that was passed in them. That makes a lot of sense, bro. Because you can, yeah. What the fuck? Your body is a portal. Your body is a ship. So every time you doing drugs, every time you doing crazy stuff, thought forms is created, bro. Thought forms will have you depressed, suicidal. Thought forms come from energies, entities. This shit is deep. This bot ass nigga right here, DDG, that D doodle garbage that y'all watching, gonna have all these little kids lost and led astray. He's a fucking plant. This is the last thing I'm gonna say about doodle garbage. Because I gotta hit the gym and I gotta keep my daily uploads going. Y'all know I post every single day now. And I've been trying to keep that shit going. The last thing I'm going to say about doodoo -doo garbage. It's a lot of fans. It's a lot of new subscribers. And I've been gone. I feel like I've been gone for the past two years. I haven't been consistent on YouTube in general in like the past couple years. A lot of y'all. You got like millions of <coughs> subscribers though. You know what I'm saying? I have no clue. And I want y'all to ask doodoo -doo garbage. How many YouTube channels have he created? Since 2015. Probably like 10. Doodle Garbage said I fell off, right? See, a lot of y'all don't know this. DDG, every time he fall off, he make a new channel. And I think he gave, like, I can't even take, I think his brother got one of his fell off channels. He gave the channels he fell off away. Matter of fact, what happened to your DDG family channel? Did you turn that into a plug channel? I bet that fell off as well. See, you talking about falling off. When you've been trying to keep your career going, you've been, my nigga, you, your health bar been blinking for the past 10 years. <laughs> One HP. On YouTube. DDG. <laughs> you literally, you can't create content alone. People watch you for the shit that you bring. You are not funny. You can't, you're not, bro, I guarantee you, DDG cannot be entertaining without talking about his jewelry, cars, and clothes. He cannot be entertaining if other people is not in his vids. He's going to create fake vids with his little family. He's been doing this shit for the past five years. Fake scripted vids with his sister and boyfriend. Fake scripted vids with celebrities. How many rappers watching this right now? 
and DDG scripted and directed your whole fake video. Whenever you see DDG on streams, whenever you see, wherever you see doodoo garbage at, it's fake, it's scripted. Everything about him is fake. So you got to ask yourself, how do he create content? He leech off people that's popping. He will, I don't know how it's possible, but every time it's a new popping streamer or a new popping YouTuber, DDG's doodoo garbage spawn out of nowhere. I don't know how. What I'm trying to tell y'all is this. You talking about I fell off because I've been gone mourning what happened to my brother, going through shit with my family. So I've been gone because I'm inactive. So you say I fell off. Tell the world how many channels you had since 2015. And the channel that you using right now, your channel that you probably getting views on, pay attention to that. It's only because of the people that's in it, not him. If he posts vids by itself, you're not going to watch it. <laughs> if he doing new things or something, it has to be something else other than him. He has very low self-esteem. This is why he has to buy jewelry for you to fuck with him. But the older you get, the more you're going to see him for what he is. Man, he be buying all this random bum ass shit that nobody even know what it is. He got to fit in. That's how he fit in. He's not accepted for who he are. He can't go out in nature and just be himself. He can't drop a video like this and just be himself. You get what I'm saying? His girlfriend ain't even his. His shit. whole life, he's a broke, dead, spiritual ass nigga, y'all. He's dead spiritually. He don't know nothing. He just want to fit in. As long as he can be around rappers, DDG is perfectly, Doodle Garbage is perfectly fine. Don't call him DDG. His name is Doodle Garbage. Simple. <laughs> That's tough, man. Now listen, like I told y'all, I haven't seen none of his content. I know from clips that he's been speaking on me, but I guarantee you everything I'm saying is facts. If you go and look at DDG most popping channel, all of the videos evolve, it involves other people, not him. That's the only way he can keep shit going. And I promise you, that channel's going to die too. He's going to sell that channel, probably give it to a family member. Man, he can—he didn't gave away a lot of channels. Y'all have no clue DDG fell off 10 times. Shit. This is why he wants to be labeled as a rapper so bad, praying he make it. <laughs> he can't even find it. He's so spiritually dead, he can't even find his sound with music. Who do DDG sound like? Everybody. You don't be like, oh, he's, you don't never hear somebody and be like, oh, that dude sound like DDG. No. Doodoo garbage sound like everybody. My nigga, you from Michigan, Detroit. Don't fuck with you. You must have been from the burbs. That's tough. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> Javante going in. I have no problem with DD doodoo garbage. I just don't understand. Why would you try to like do that to me while I'm going through some of the toughest times. I don't even speak on you. I always find myself responding to you. But listen, this is enough. That's all I gotta say. You can't name five DDG songs. It's not possible. You can't. What is five of DDG's greatest hits? You can't name it. I only know one song, to be honest. I'm walking Calabas. Get Calabas is the one in which he, he made the um. It was this and him, man. I don't know, I don't know the little one, Geeky. Now you making music. I told you you make music for niggas who wear open toe sandals with no With no socks, was mom's carrot. Socks. Remember I told you that? <laughs> now you just saying. <laughs> with the split in between the toes. I'm a geeky. <laughs> like, bro, that's I don't even wear those sandals. Bro, TikTok is serious. TikTok can have you thinking your song really popping. It happened to me with my Are We Living in a Dream. Remember, Will Smith even did a TikTok to my song, bro. After those five seconds, niggas is not listening to your song, doo doo garbage. Say goodbye. <laughs> Simple. I even show you on Spotify. Nigga, I got heli streams. They ran my shit up on TikTok. Y'all know I did my whole album at home from my Yeti mic. <laughs> what? Did they no, actually? It's, this it's guy is a god, man. <laughs> With his Yeti mic. Y'all know I did my whole album at home from my Yeti mic. <laughs> no edits and still got millions of streams just to show y'all you don't have to do none of that weird shit these industry niggas be doing do it yourself anyway man i love this nigga man i love his energy bro you know what i'm saying do it yourself that's right man that's the right mindset to have and make your own you know what i'm saying guys i really hope you did enjoy if you did enjoy be sure to subscribe leave a like and check out the other videos too i love you guys have a great rest of your day man and i'm out